maybe you escaped from the local orphanage, I don't know. But whose child is this? I'm just curious. I'm just curious. Is this, is this a joke or is this... Okay, all right, let's, let's play this game. Okay, I'm gonna have a professional wrestling match with Marco Scott. Okay, okay, okay. Well, buddy, uh, let me just get down your level here so you can hear me. Uh... <laughs> small that in order to wipe your ass you probably use two floss but <laughs> I'm gonna explain this to you real slow you don't have a chance in the world do you understand me these people might love to chant your name but oh, you don't see what <laughs> So Marco Stunt seems like a man of the people. I don't think he would uh, not include anybody. He's an all-inclusive kind of guy. I I, I love all-inclusive oh. corn dog parties, and and you know I think he can slam them. I really do. I believe in him. I I 100% believe in him. Because if I speak it into existence, and create that positive karma. It has. Oh, uh, wow. MJF's just a bully. Standing on the back now of Marco Stunt. Using those ropes to add more leverage and more weight to the back of Marco Stunt. Hard on to the leg. And you know what? That's, that's what you gotta do, honestly, if you're MJF. So much of Marco Stunt's momentum is created uh, from his legs and a lot of his offense uh, is he needs that momentum on his side because of his small stature take out the legs keep him grounded and now apply this bear hug that keeps him right in the middle of the ring and in danger of not being able to complete this match well i mean th this is uh totally not good on your internal organs as well it's di very difficult to draw in a breath and if it's difficult for you to breathe, it's going to be hard for you to create that momentum that your offense needs. So this is a, a multifaceted, well-targeted approach by MJF. I hate to give the devil his due, but right now, 
He's doing well, and Marco stunned. Has him halfway. Looking for that body slam. What? Tilt a whirl right into a backbreaker. And, and you gotta think. What, what MJF is doing in this match, you know, perhaps uh, this is his uh, mental game of chess, that he's now gotten the idea of, oh, I'm gonna body slam this guy into the mind of Marco Stunt. Notice, every time Marco Stunt goes for that body slam, it doesn't work, it gets countered. I mean, this is a great multi-faceted psychological approach by MJF, I really gotta, I really gotta say. I can see the look on your face and how much it bothers you to give that man any sort of credit. Especially when it comes to the clear crowd favorite, Marco Stunt. Oh yeah, don't get me wrong, I love Marco Stunt. Uh, and quite honestly, I very much dislike uh, MJF. I've known MJF for a number of years. I've never liked him. Uh, always been disingenuous. Completely understand it, yeah, I believe it. But you can't argue with the success that he's had in the sport. That's 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 he's a good great. he's a good wrestler, and that's why you hate him even more. Oh, Margo went right for the eyes there. Here we go. Look at that, using that momentum, leaping off the top rope. Now trips him up. Does Marco stunt? Now Marco stunt. He's going to have to start moving at a little bit of a faster rate. I know it's going to be difficult for him to do, but he needs to move at an accelerated pace. String maneuvers together, catch MJF off guard, catch him in a pinning combination, something. He definitely has to take the pace of this match into yeah. his own hands here. A pair of drop kicks may have started that off. Uh, went to the well one too many times, went for a third drop kick. MJF saw that one coming. Marco able to get out of that backdrop suplex situation. Swing and a miss by Marco Stunt. Look at that. Big old knee right on the chin. Oh man, that was a close one. Let me tell you, he jacked his jaw something fierce with that knee. I believe he may have stunned MJF momentarily. I believe that kick out was just MJF's body twitching. Yeah, but this makes me nervous. Going back to the body slam, it hasn't worked for him thus far. Can he do it? Will it work now? And again. MJF is just too big. Oh, good sweet God. Jesus. Alabama slam into that Boston Crab. All over the map here. And Bryce Remsburg right in the face of Marco Stunt, asking Marco if he wants to give it up. Marco's way too proud to give up. I mean, and you may have heard in the ring introductions by Low Life Louie, there's a 100 pound weight advantage for MJF. And that is absolutely crucial in a situation like this. Absolutely true, but Marco's still able to utilize his own leverage, get to the ropes and break that hold. And you know, perhaps some of that was MJF knowing that, you know, maybe maybe the Boston Crab wasn't working, he knew it wasn't gonna finish a match, but let him Marco Sun exert the energy to make it to the ropes. Let him do the work, let him right. get tired. That's more of a chance I have of keeping the shoulders pinned to the mat. And then move on to the next series of maneuvers. And and right now, he's just browbeating the kid, is MJF. I still fought your mom. Oh, -ho! I believe that is now two members of the Game Changer Wrestling roster whose mom Marco Stunt has copulated with. Yeah, man, he's like a, like a battle rapper. Out here having sex with everybody. Torture him. Absolutely. I had to finish that set. Oh! Look at that, into a jaw jacker. I think he got the knee up into the chin. Marco Son again calling for the body slam. Again, I gotta call this into question. He got He did it! He did it! He beat him! He did it! Bring it!
This is great news. I was actually starving. That but is absolutely astounding.